afternoon. My name is Mark Reed and I'm the director of the ACE Plus program. And with me today is... Harry Singh, one of the program advisors with the ACE Plus program. And Frederick Canales, another advisor with the ACE Plus program. I thought we would uh, have a little discussion today about academic progress reports and communication between advisors and instructors. So let's start with uh, the first question I have for you all. Yes, can you tell me why we have academic progress reports? All right, thank you, Mark. Uh, the purpose of the progress report is uh, we use it as a measuring stick to see how well our students are doing in the program or in particular class and or, unfortunately, how well they're not doing in the class. Uh, so pro the purpose of the prog uh, progress report is uh, one of the, the tool we use to communicate with our instructor to uh, communicate back to the advisors to give us the progress uh, as far as how the students are doing in the particular class. Okay, Fred, what do you do with the results of the academic progress reports? Well, once the report hits my desk or, or any advisor's desk, the advisor then reacts to that report by looking at what is the status of the student progress. If the teacher has indicated poor progress, then the advisor takes actions to get with that student either at, out at the high school or here in the office and determine what the problem is or what intervention is needed to help that student bring the performance level up. Uh, it's sometimes a matter of just motivation. But sometimes they need tutoring. But with the communication between the teacher and the advisor, uh, interventions can be formulated and uh, hopefully we'll have a higher student success rate. Good. Can you tell me why communication between advisors and instructors is so important? Okay. Uh, communication is important at any level at any job, uh, particularly, particularly with the ACE Plus uh, program. Uh, it is important uh, for uh, not only for the instructor and the, uh, and the advisor to have a good communication, but uh, I, I use it as a triangle where the student and instructor and advisor actually have active communication throughout the semester. Uh, the importance of the communication with the instructor and uh, advisor is that uh, we can actually uh, catch the students uh, who might be on, uh, um, you know, as far as falling through the crack. Uh, for example, uh, whenever I receive uh, a progress report from instructor, I follow up with the instructor to wanting to find out in detail what is the situation or the status of the student uh, up to date. So I use that information uh, or that communication uh, and take it back to the student and uh, figure out uh, where we can help as an uh, ACE Plus program advisor and uh, as a GCC what kind of uh, resources we can offer to them. So communication with the instructor and the, and the advisor is a must because that's the only way we're going to be able to help the student uh, accordingly. Anything you want to add there, Fred? Well, I think uh, Harry alluded to earlier the communications triangle, the teacher, the student, and the advisor. And I, I can't emphasize enough how critically important that is. Uh, I strongly urge any instructors to please, please feel free to communicate with us at any time come to our office, call us, email us, uh, any form of communication, but it's all about student success, so we do need to communicate. Good, and that brings us to our last question then. What can instructors do to facilitate communication about students' performance? Well, the best thing for instructors to do is utilize those progress reports that were mentioned earlier and give as much detail as possible regarding a student who is maybe in trouble. Those progress reports are trying to serve to give us a red flag about a particular student so that we can take action to help them. The other thing our instructors can do is to not stay away. Come and visit us, come and see us. Our, we have open door policy here, they can come see us anytime. They need to just come in, uh, you know, email, text, telephone call, the main thing is to just make sure they do communicate with us. Do we have coffee for the instructors? On Saturdays, we try to have coffee and some donuts for the instructors. Uh, we hopefully, they'll come in and uh, we can chat about students over coffee. 
Very good. Okay, thank you both. Thank you.